everyone my name is Ashley welcome back to my kitchen again today I want to show you a meal prep for the uh, meal prep delicious sandwich for your work week so what we're gonna do is today very very delicious now first of all we have to use this very delicious lavash bread they call it lavash it's very very healthy and it's very very thin low carb you can get any kind of market you can see how thin it is Usually, I like to fold the sandwich like this, especially for my husband. It's very thin, and when you make the sandwich, so it doesn't rip. So it's very, very tasty dish it is. So over here today, I made the brisket meat, or any kind of meat you like, ham, cheese, uh, you know, like uh, cold cuts, or whatever, but usually we don't buy it. I like to do everything homemade. It's a brisket or beef or chicken whichever you like you can prepare it usually like i did the chicken paprika a few minutes ago you can take some of the white chicken or any kind of chicken that you buy you can put in a dish uh, you can uh, clean it up and prepare it now first you put the meat and then you will take the white, in case if you don't like the use the white onion for uh, at work, which it doesn't smell, but if it does, it's okay. But if you don't like it, it's optional, you don't have to, but it will make it very, very delicious sandwich with this, with this meat. So you spread it like this. You put some tomatoes, very tasty, because you want to make it kind of juicy, so it will be nice and it goes down very comfortable then you put some red bell pepper if you like to put green that's fine too it works and you put green onion this green onion are very very tasty we don't have you can chop it you can just put it like this way so when you eat it doesn't have to fall you can put as much as you want and then here the way I you see it's a pickle that I made it's only for a couple of days it should stay a little bit more next time in case if you like it I would love to show you to teach you and uh, it's a turnip or a turnip pickle with the real, um, with the bits it's very tasty so this is how you do it in case if you like mayonnaise uh, you can put and the mustard you just like spread it a little bit as as much as you want you just go once twice like this it's fine mayonnaise if you don't want if you're on diet you don't have to put it if you like you can just put very little all right let's see a few drops here and there there you go you don't have to put too much because already the bread is fine and there is plenty stuffing in it so look how delicious it looks and it's appetizing you can just fold it like this way the bottom you can fold it if you want otherwise you have to put of course the foil this is the way you do if it's too big for you guys you just cut in half there we go and look how delicious it looks already and this one you take it to your work with you you put in a paper foil and you take it to work here already I made two sandwiches for my kids and this is for my husband and maybe one for me or maybe two of them for him so you wrap it in a paper foil and you take it to work it's very tasty delicious it's uh, healthy and you will enjoy it there you go you can give a little juice with this healthy carrot juice or from the tree you pick up orange and you squeeze the orange juice or your lemon which I do have in my garden and there you go for the week sandwich for the family I hope you'll make it and you will enjoy it and I want to show you one thing that I did the pecan a few minutes ago we did the chicken paprika and here it is already done you see how much liquid it left from one cup and this is very delicious you can eat with pasta like I said rice pilaf or with the mashed potato it's very delicious enjoy it and have fun and I hope you'll try it
Thank you for watching again. Bye-bye.